Good morning, good day, and good night wherever you may be. This is Art Thomas, and I have acquired ataxia from seizures and strokes to the cerebellum. My manual dexterity is slowly getting better which I am starting to gain more control of my extremities. In South Carolina golf carts are allowed on the road. This will be the next step towards driving. I don't mean to sound like a broken record, but driving is my number one goal. I should work on talking and getting a job, which I'm working on, but I can't do what I want unless I'm able to drive. Not all of us that suffer from ataxia are unable to drive, but if you are unable to drive keep trying to work on it. People said I most likely won't get out of the wheelchair, but I did do the constant exercise to push the nervous system. Whatever your goal do not give up on that goal. Keep trying no matter how frustrating it is. Because I got out of the wheelchair and able to walk due to constant exercise I know it's possible to return to driving. If you have a goal find that will that I know you have. If there's a will there's a way. Because I have been using the tractor, go-kart, and Tesla, link in the description below, to help me drive and go to the next step was to use the golf cart on the road. Why use a golf cart you may ask? Well, in South Carolina you are able to drive the golf cart on the street. No, I did not go on the actual highway, but I did drive in the neighborhood to see if it's possible to drive. This is what you see in the video. I'm just driving around the neighborhood so I don't hurt anyone. Please ignore the colors of this golf cart. This is my neighbor's golf cart, and they are giant Ohio State American football fans. They were very generous to let me use it, and I'm truly grateful for that. No matter your circumstance I always say beggars can't be choosers. If you have issues with your manual dexterity like I do the use of your arms and hands can be very difficult. The thing you can do is keep doing exercises that help with manual dexterity. In other words, your fine motor skills. This is where occupational therapy, OT, can help, but you have to be willing to do exercises non-stop even when someone from OT is not around. Little Steps Big Gains is a YouTube channel you really need to check out, I'll put a link in the description below, if you have issues with your fine motor skills which can play a huge role in driving. Ataxia really affects fine motor skills because it's coordination of small muscles, but this means you shouldn't give up. As always, it's so important to get this content out there because most people including some doctors do not know anything about ataxia. Please help the channel out and bring awareness to ataxia, which is extremely rare, by pressing that like button, sharing this video, subscribing to the channel, and click that bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos. It's all free and thank you.